Chapter 3, Mishnah 1. The Mishnah lists types of lulav that are invalid. A stolen lulav or a dry one is invalid. The lulav of a asheria, i.e. a tree that was worshipped as an idol, or of a subverted town, i.e. a town of idol worshippers, is invalid. A lulav whose top was cut off or had most of its leaves torn off is invalid. The Mishnah turns to cases in which the lulav is valid. If its leaves are spread apart like the branches of a tree, but they are attached to the lulav, it is valid. Rabbi Huda says, in order for such a lulav to be valid, one must bind the leaves together at the top of the lulav so that they lie against the spine. Lulavs from the palms of the Iron Mountain, whose leaves are short and sparse, are valid. A lulav that has the length of three tefachim, which is the minimum length of the Hadassim and Aravos that are bound together with it, plus another Tafach above the Hadassim and Aravos with which to wave it, with which to wave it is valid.